It's summer, which means short season has arrived. Today I'm going to take you through all the different lengths that are available since it's a wonderful way to keep cool once those summer temps have arrived. It's all coming up next at Style at a Certain Age. Hi ladies, it's Beth. Thanks so much for stopping by today. Yes, we have a very fun and perhaps a little bit controversial subject, which is shorts for the over 50 woman. But I'm here to tell you, if you like shorts and you still like to rock that, there's definitely a length for you. But before we get into the video, a very warm welcome. Don't forget to hit the subscription box down below so you don't miss any videos coming your way. Again, I'm over on uh, Facebook and Instagram, Style at a Certain Age, and a lovely blog, lots of lifestyle inspiration, and that's at styledacertainage.com. So one question I'm asked over and over again on the blog is, uh, what is the perfect length of short for the over 50 woman, if any? And I don't think there are any hard and fast rules about length of shorts. I believe that it is a personal preference and what you feel comfortable and confident in wearing. And we all know there are many of you that just don't plain like shorts, period, end of story. But the good news is that there are plenty of other options to wear once, you know, summer rolls into town and they're, they're hotter temps. You know, think crop pants or flared pants. Um, you can go with culottes, you can go with a maxi skirt or a really cool midi dress. So lots and lots of options out there for the over 50 woman if they don't like shorts. But for today's video, we are discussing all things shorts. So uh, stay tuned for the perfect length for you. So there are about four to five different short lengths out there. And for today's video, I will also just classify them into short, medium, and long. But the first up is uh, the three, four, or five inch shorts. And those are the very short shorts. And some of us may want to steer clear of those because we just really think it's just revealing a little bit too much information. But I will point out that short shorts are perfect for a petite or a shorter woman because it's really going to elongate and lengthen their legs. So think about that. And then also, just even for someone like me, I do wear four inch shorts and five inch shorts. I think they're perfect for, uh, you know, the backyard barbecue or, you know, running errands. Uh, one thing that I do like to do when I'm wearing short shorts is if I'm revealing a lot of leg, uh, then I'll come along and I'll like put a button down or a button up and, uh, or, or a sweater. So that's just really a style rule that I just really kind of adhere to is that if, if uh, one part of my body is more exposed and I'll cover up another body. But short shorts, don't completely discount them. Again, perfect for the petite woman or a shorter woman to elongate their legs and great for a backyard barbecue. So the next short is a medium length short or many times they're called a classic short. This is typically a seven inch inseam. And this is probably the most popular short out there, especially for the over 50 woman. It's, it's really the Goldilocks of the shorts. So it's not too short and it's not too long. It does re reveal a little bit of your leg and they're really great for a hot summer day. You can dress them up, you can dress them down. Um, I love to wear flats, ballet flats with them. I also love to you know throw on a pair of heels. You can add a blazer. As I said, you can make it dressy. I mean, there's just a lot of things that you can do with a classic short and uh, J. Crew does a really great job. I have a couple of pairs. I have um, the classic khaki and I have white. And, uh, and as I said, this is the most popular pair of shorts for the over 50 woman. So the third and last type of short is the long short. Sometimes they're called a boardwalk short or most commonly called a Bermuda short. And this typically is an 11 inch inseam which lands right above your knee. And this is the short that women like to wear if they wanna hide a few imperfections. Maybe their legs, they're not feeling confident with their legs being toned as they once were when they're in their 20s and 30s, or they have varicose veins that they would really rather hide. So uh, a Bermuda short is a, just a, really a beautiful length. You do have to be careful that it's not going to creep past your, your, the top of your knee because then you're going to throw all of your proportions off. So 
Um, for me, I'm, I'm tall, so when I put a pair of shorts on, they, they typically hit me right where I want it to. But if you need to uh, enlist a tailor to just you know hit it right above your knee, then go ahead and do that, and then your proportions are going to be great. Again, this is a, a short that you can dress up with heels. Um, you can rock it with you know a, maybe a cool chic leather jacket uh, if the temps are a little bit uh, more on the mild side. You can take it, you know, and just again dress it down with a graphic tee or just, you know, a plain tee. Lots and lots of options with that Bermuda short that really hits the sweet spot for most women over 50. And I don't want to forget that uh, since I'm a blue jean mama and I love my denim, denim shorts are a great option too. And they also come in a variety of lengths. They come from the very short shorts. I mean, uh, we all know about the Daisy Dukes. Um, I'm not rocking those anymore, but I typically end up with about um, the, the classic short for my denim shorts, and I, and I love to cuff them too. So you can leave them uncuffed or cuff them, but lots of different ways to rock that denim short come summer as well. So I have an easy style tip if you're still confused about which length of short is right for you, and that is just take your arms and just let them hang on the side of your body and where your fingertip ends, that will be the perfect length of short for you. So that would be a classic short for me, so that's about seven inches. And that's actually one of the shorts that I love to wear the most. So super easy way if you're still confused about which length to go. Okay, see, it is not so hard to talk about shorts for the over 50 woman. And as I said, there is definitely a length out there for you if that's one of the ways that you like to uh, dress up an outfit or dress it down. Because again, very versatile shorts are uh, in the realm of style. But I, I just uh, wanted to thank you for stopping by. Of course, I want you to give me a thumbs up if you like the video, share it with a friend, and don't forget to hit that subscription box. And I'll see you again very, very soon. Bye-bye.